Hey everybody! I'm here today to do a review of this Bosch wall scanner. This is specifically the Bosch GMS 120 wall scanner. Once again, this is the Bosch GMS 120 wall scanner. And in this video review, I'll be going over the features and functions with you as well as telling you about my own personal experience and personal opinion with the product. Let's get right into the video. This wall scanner finds and detects wood, metal, and more. It's absolutely awesome. And I'm getting nervous tossing it around in the air like this. Even though I'm a drummer, so I do this all the time, it makes me nervous because this is a pricey product and it's well worth the money. Very simple and easy to use. You have this display right here. You have a hole where you can use, you have a hole that you can use to mark on the wall if you're looking for studs, let's say. And then you have this illumination on these lights right here. Really easy to use. You turn it on. Very simple, okay? Very, very simple. Um, this right here allows you to turn the display on and off. This allows you to turn the audio on and off. I've never used them. I like the audio, I like the display, so I just leave them on. Okay, you can detect, you can detect wood, as you can see right there. You can detect metal, which can be used for metal studs or, or metal uh, nails or screws in the wall, okay? And you can detect uh, power lines, okay? Um, metal can also be used to detect piping. It all depends on what you have in the wall. Really, really useful tool, okay? Now, in this wall right here, this is a garage, and in this wall, there's there are wooden studs behind this drywall. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use this to detect where the wooden studs are, okay? I have to say, I use this quite a bit. I have quite a bit of experience using this, and my opinion is that it is extremely accurate, but what they explain in the manual, uh, from what I remember, and what I've learned to do over the years of using various stud finders and various wall scanners, is just go over the area multiple times. If you really want to make sure there's a stud there, go over it, let's say, two times, or even three times, and if it detects a stud every time, you're good to go. And you use a good old knocking method. Very simple, okay? Very, very simple. In addition, in this garage, for instance, I can see that, that there's a tape right here. They obviously, because it's a garage, they didn't do that. The builder didn't do that good of a job at tape, mudding and taping. So I can see that there's tape right here. I'm going to assume that there's a stud here. I'm assuming the wall scanner will find a tube. There might not be a stud technically, but there probably is. I mean, there are other ways to join pieces of drywall, but it's probably a stud. I have it on wood mode. Place it on the wall. Give it a few moments. There are contact pads on the back. Let me show you this. Use this uh, a, a battery, as you can see right there. There are contact pads on the back. All of these have to be touching um, to allow it to sense. And you can see it says sensor right there because the sensor lives right there. So place it on the wall. Actually, we're going to start. We're going to start over here. You're going to see it illuminate. Now you see right there it illuminates, right? You know what? Let's come closer. What are you guys so far away for? Come closer over here. Enough nonsense, okay? Place it on the wall. Okay, once again, you see it illuminates right there. As I move it along, it's going to start showing me when it's going to start sensing a stud. I'm trying to stay out of the way here from the view. Oh, so it's starting to sense a stud there, a wooden stud, as you can see. It also tells you when you've reached the center. Okay, just like that. Very simple. Another one. Now, this is that tape line that I was talking to you about, and it says the center of the stud is right there, which makes sense. What I would do, let's take that off. I would put my pencil through that hole and I would mark it off like that, okay? Sorry, that was my hand on the back there setting off the sensors. Now, once again, I would go again, allow it to pick up, okay? No problem, and I would go and I would scan. All right, as you can see right here. So, once again, the same spot. It's telling me there's a stud here. Same spot, okay? Go nice and slowly. So, and it's telling me there's a stud here with the tape line again. So I did it twice, it's telling me there's a stud somewhere around here, I'm not marking it because I'm not drilling into the wall, somewhere around here and somewhere around here um, as well. So basically it's telling me that there is a stud there and there, so that would make total sense that, that, uh, that there are studs there, okay? It shows that it works. And like I said, I can use it for uh, metal as well as uh, the electrical. Um, it all depends on what you're looking for, but overall this is absolutely awesome and I really hope you've enjoyed this video review of this Bosch GMS 120 wall scanner. It's an incredible product. I just wanted to tell you about the features and also demonstrate myself using it um, as sort of a demonstration in this video.
video. It's extremely accurate. Um, it definitely will, it, it's one of the more expensive stud finders you can find, but it does an amazing, scratch that, a phenomenal job at what it does. And that's it, if you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.